All right, so let me usually start by looking at the how the last week that I that I taped turned out, and I loved this kit. This made me smile every time I looked at it. I love the colors. I love the coffee theme. I thought it was great. Um, it turned out just beautiful. Then there was this current week, because today it's Friday, uh, February 3rd. I really wanted to put a plan with me up for this one, but I was sick, and I kept losing my voice for most of um, this starting Friday afternoon, and all day Saturday, all day Sunday, I just kept losing my voice. I couldn't talk. So it didn't work to do a plan with me. But this, I think, is my favorite kit I've used in this planner so far. I love this kit. Um, it's beautiful. But let's move on to what we're doing today. We are planning February 6th through the 12th. And this is actually a free kit for members of the Bling Bling Planner Club. And you join the club, the Bling Bling Planner Club. Uh, Etsy shop has a link on her Etsy store to join her club and by being a member of that club you get a free planner kit once a month and this is the January kit just got it a couple of days ago but I think it's gorgeous I love the mag I guess they're magnolias I think yeah it was called magnolia so it must be what it is love this I think it's so pretty and I debated whether I wanted to use it, but I said, yeah, I want to use it because it's so pretty. But there are things it doesn't have. But it was free. So I spent some money and bought, well, not only these stickers, but a bunch more, too. I bought some nice skinny uh, three-heart checklists. And I bought some, mainly I wanted the half boxes. And then this also came with quarter boxes. I'll have links to this shop as well as these two sets of stickers on the blog post. So let's get started. I'm going to cut out the washi tape strips. I'm going to cut out everything I need, the today, the to-do bit headers, the stuff for this box and the today headers and the weekend banner. When I get that all cut out, I'll be back and we'll put it down. All right, so I tried to pick colors of the things I needed to add that seem to be in the, the kit. So hopefully I did. We need to get these to-do headers all the way, whoops, I've got two there, the way across. So I think what I'll do is I'll put the to-do headers, whoops, all the way across, and the today headers all the way across on this line, and then I'll be back and we'll put the uh, other stuff down. All right, so those are all down. I did put them on here because this doesn't quite go all the way, but I think I think I'm going to wait until I put my date covers on to put the weekend banner down. So next, let's decide where each of these half boxes is going, because that's usually the next thing I do. So I want this one on Monday, I think. Right there. Let me trade these along around. Let's see, this one is similar to that one, so I'm going to put it on the far end. Let's put this one here. This one. And this one. And there. There, I like that. So hopefully you can still see. I think once all the stickers are down, the colors will make more sense, but that color was kind of in there, and I really like that color, so. background noise if the camera is picking up is the kitten playing. The kitten has two speeds, full speed ahead and dead asleep. He has nothing in between. One 
on this one. Something is crooked there, but I'm just going to ignore it. Now we have five little check flags to go under these to do's. So, oh, I didn't trim that one. I forgot to trim the flag end. And since I don't know if it's going to go down over the boxes, I better get that done. All right. So. I'm going to put a brown one, and I'm only going Monday through Friday with these. So. Brown one here, and a brown one here. I think this, this one. That kind of divides the pinks up as far apart as possible. They weren't perfect pinks, but they were okay. Well, I am going to peel the back off of these little flags. I can tell that's going to take a while. Then I'm going to cut out the check boxes and the full boxes for here, and then I'll be back. All right, so I'm just going to alternate these check boxes. So I put the, the kind of steel ones every other one, and then these are, I guess, wood grain, I guess. Put these down. See how fast I can do this and not make them crooked. That one's got that one I cut really crooked on the top, I see. Come on, don't go crooked now. Going so well. That's really crooked. But I don't see any hope for it because it was not going to go not crooked. Go. Usually when they're just a little bit crooked, I... Uh, don't really notice by the time I get the whole thing decorated. So now the full boxes are going below these, and I already decided that one's going there. And there's four of these. Now these do continue on to the next box, but I decided I didn't want to do that. So, so you could put them next to each other and have a continuous thing there, I guess, but I'm going to do this. Something like that. Overlap that just a little bit so we don't have that bright pink header showing. I find that's usually the best way to keep from having this header showing. It's just overlap just a tiny bit. that far over, but whatever.
And now, since the pink one is up here, we know the pink one then needs to go here. It's not quite straight, but it's fine. And then there's one black background and one brown. I think I'll put the brown one over here. Oops, put this over here so I don't lose it. down the bottom washi and then I am going to uh, get the date covers ready to go. So let's see where I'm going to put this. Go put, it, put it at the top of that. I do prefer when the washi bottom washi is wider, but I really don't think I have anything to go with this, so I'm just going to leave the pink showing at the bottom. There's quite a bit of pink in this kit, so I think it's okay. Ah, that's not straight. Come on, come back, come back. There we go. And that's sticking over. That's interesting. Just throw my scissors at myself. Okay, good enough. All right, I am going to get the date covers ready and probably get some of the stuff for the sidebar and the hydrate stickers cut out. Then I'll be back.